Good afternoon, everybody. If you're new here, this is Eat with Nala. My name is Nala, and I like to eat and travel the world. So, we are going to McDonald's. I am in Thailand. I'm in Thailand. I'm in Phuket specifically. And we're going to try Thailandian McDonald's to see what it's talking about. I'm very excited. Um, I've always wanted to come here. If you know, then you know. But yeah, we're here and I'm getting this app called Grab. And I'm going to get on a, like a motorbike basically. And it's 36 baht, which is $1.01. Very cheap, and it's like a five minute drive. So, I'll see you guys when we get there. I'm so excited. Okay, guys, so they said no recording, so I have to eat outside, but I got my food. So, we have the fries. They taste normal, but with the fries, we got cheese sauce, okay? So we're gonna try that. I saw this and I was like, I have to try the cheese sauce. Okay, so the cheese sauce is cold. It's not too bad though. It's salty. The fries taste the exact same. So yeah, it's not that bad. Okay guys, now we have the Samurai Burger. This is new. Um, it has bacon and cheese as well. I know it's pork and I think a teriyaki sauce. Okay. Yeah. Never seen anything like it at McDonald's. Hmm. Guys, so it's pretty good. It's really um, moist. Um, guys, it's pretty good. It's like a barbecue sauce, kind of. Teriyaki. It has the typical McDonald's mayo. I'll say it's nothing special. So this is what I was excited for. This is the spicy fried chicken. I've never had fried chicken from McDonald's. It looks so good. Very crispy. Nah. They had me fooled, but honestly, it's really dry. I didn't get a dipping sauce on the side. I saw that they had a spicy barbecue, so maybe that would have done it. But, I mean, for McDonald's, it's not that bad. Would it be something I come back and order? No. Wait, I beg to differ. They have a fried chicken hot sauce. I didn't see it. So we'll try that. Chicken, hot sauce. Okay, it's giving me sweet and sour. It's not bad, but it's not. <coughs> Ooh, that hit the back of my throat. It's not bad, but it's not great. These are called patongos or patongos. Um, it looks like a fried bread. Really crispy. Okay, that's good. That's good. It's pretty basic, but it tastes really fresh. It's very soft. Okay. It was supposed to come with sweetened condensed milk, but they forgot it. That's okay, though. I'll imagine it with the condensed milk is saying it's good. If you've ever had, like, cinna sticks from a pizza place or something, that's what it's giving. But it's really fresh. So we have this pineapple pie. I'm excited. Pineapple pie. Oh. Oh, it's hot. off the rip it's very crispy it's really good it has like a pina colada flavor oh my 
God. I like this. Now, instead of apple pie, they have pineapple pie. And it matches the whole theme. And it's really good. And they actually have a McFlurry with this in it. I know it'll be good with some ice cream. But yeah, it's fresh, it's crispy, it's hot. It's exactly what you'd expect. So. Yo, so my favorite thing was <laughs> the pineapple pie. Definitely would order that again. I'll bring you guys somewhere else. The video wasn't as long as I wanted it to be, so we're gonna go get a drink or a fruit or something like that. It is really hot, so we're gonna get something refreshing to drink. I'm here at this place. I'm not sure what it's called. We're gonna get a fruit shake. You guys, it's really cool here, look. This was perfect to finish off the video, but I'm going to head home, um, get cool. So thank you guys so much for watching if you made it to the end. If you have any suggestions for what I should eat in Thailand, let me know. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next video.